Hello children, today we'll be doing the Sprout House experiment. First we need a plate, four sponges, toothpicks, some seeds, a pair of scissors, and some water. First we're going to use one sponge as the base, then the second sponge we're going to cut into half, just like this. And taking the third sponge, we're going to cut it in thirds, like this. With our last piece of sponge, we're going to cut it in half to make the roof. Now we're going to take some toothpicks and insert them to the bottom of the sponge, like this. And then we're going to poke it into the base sponge to make the walls. Now we're going to continue with the rest of the walls. Continue to insert toothpicks into the sponge like before. We're going to keep going and insert the wall into the base sponge again. And keep going until all four walls are up. Once all four walls are up, we're going to use some toothpicks to insert it to the sides to make sure it's secure. Now we're going to do the roof. Do the same with the roof. Insert the toothpicks in to secure the two parts. You can attach the bottom of the house to the roof with more toothpicks. Now you can get the seeds and put a bit of water in it. And you can give it a stir with a popsicle stick to make a seed slurry. And once you're done mixing your seed slurry, you can smear it on the roof of the house with the popsicle stick. You can put some on the bottom of the house as well, like this. After we're done putting all the seeds on the house, we're just going to pour some water into the plate, like this. And we're going to pour some water on top of the roof as well, just to moisten the seeds, or you can use a misting bottle. Now get your recording sheet and record the date and write down what you've planted. I've planted chia seeds. We're also going to write down five things a plant needs to grow big and strong. And now we're going to draw what our plant looks like today. I'm going to draw our sprout house with the sponges and the seeds. I'm also going to color it in like this. You can do that as well. And we're going to continue to make our observations every day.